Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart, one of the greatest composers in history, is widely known for his contributions to classical music. However, there is another side of Mozart that is less well-known but equally intriguing, his involvement with the Freemasons. The Freemasons were a fraternal organization that originated in the late 16th or early 17th century. They were known for their secrecy and their belief in the importance of morality, charity, and brotherhood. The organization attracted members from all walks of life, including artists, politicians, and intellectuals. Mozart became a member of the Freemasons in 1784, when he was 28 years old. His father, Leopold Mozart, had been a member of the organization as well. Mozart's involvement with the Freemasons is reflected in his music, particularly in his Masonic-themed compositions. One of Mozart's most famous Masonic compositions is the opera, The Magic Flute. The opera, which premiered in 1791, includes a number of Masonic symbols and themes, including the concept of brotherhood and the search for wisdom and enlightenment. Mozart's involvement with the Freemasons was an important aspect of his life and work. His Masonic compositions reflect his commitment to the ideals of brotherhood and enlightenment, and his participation in Masonic ceremonies and rituals attest to his dedication to the organization. While the true nature of his relationship with the Freemasons remains a subject of debate, there is no doubt that his music and his involvement with the organization have left an enduring legacy.